consider this your holiday laser light show. What you're seeing is the pattern created by crossed diffraction gratings. Diffraction gratings are simply slits that are uh, made in some opaque material that allow light to travel through them. And in this case, what I've done is I've placed two diffraction gratings, one of them vertical and the other horizontal, one after the other. Let's look at the gratings. Here they are. The one in front is a series of vertical uh, slits, and then the one in back is a series of horizontal slits. If I take out the one in the back, the pattern that I see is a one-dimensional version of what you saw before. Now, you shouldn't think that the number of uh, dots that you see horizontally here has anything to do with the number of slits in the glass slides. In fact, um, I would have a similar pattern even if I had only two slits. The fact that I see so many slits is indicative of the fact that light is behaving like a wave rather than a series of particles, a beam of particles. And the fact that the red light is spread further apart is because red has a longer wavelength than green. Now I can go back and show you what the lasers look like. Here they are. They have been uh, lovingly tied together in such a way so that the beam from the green light and the beam from the red light combine at the same point on the first diffraction grating. Now, let me show you what the diffraction grating looks like. Here is a schematic of it. And what you see is that uh, on the right-hand side here, we have sets of two slits that are uh, successively closer and closer together. In the middle, we have a set of uh, multiple slits of different uh, sizes and different uh, densities. And then I have other sets of uh, slits, including single slits over here. And this is what uh, the inside of that uh, diffraction grating uh, slide assembly looks like. I have two pieces of glass. In between them is this piece of plastic that's mostly black, except for these, uh, these slit patterns that are etched into them to allow light to go through. And this one in the very center is the one that's masked off in this uh, array right here. So I'll leave you with this laser light show and remind you that this demonstration shows us that light behaves like a wave rather than a beam of particles.